Hi, welcome to the video about Adic Linux B Budgie. I've created two ISOs today, Budgie and Mate. And uh, this is the video to create Budgie. So we have three ways now to install Arc Linux on our system. We have the Arc Linux ISO, 2 gigabytes big, the left side here. Then this Arc Linux D, a minimal one, uh, without any desktop. So you choose the desktop and install it with a, a bunch of scripts. Third way is the last project we've done here is phase four and build your own ISO. The vision is if I can build an ISO, so can you. So there is an option here, do nothing, just burn the ISO like I do and put it on SourceForge or change the applications or decide to have only one of the desktops that we have created, that we have visited already here. All the articles apply and here's phase three is everything else but the three from Arc Linux. So any of these uh, will work eventually on an ISO like this and it's actually not that difficult to make a your own ISO so the budgie one is um, I guess not yet in the menu so it's gonna be called budgie and what we're gonna do is we are going to build our own Arch Linux budgie with a git clone from here Control c and then we're going to open a new window on our desktop open terminal git clone Control shift v oops you can't do twice git clone of course just once is enough and there we go we have arco budgie installed on our system and all you need to know is that in the installation script there you can run number 30 <clears throat> and when you run this there are some phases you go through so you just uh, follow along it says he says what he's going to do at this point in time it's your not your, your computer is not broken it just takes a while because i have already a build folder and the build folder is where eventually the iso will go into so now there is three yeses you just read the question but three yeses basically and then he's off and he's running his script at the bottom um, bottom line is that he'll have a folder and in this folder we'll get a work folder and in this uh, well another work folder yes we get a work folder as well but an out folder that's important so the word is here but there's an out folder that's going to be added and there you have the ISO and that's the one you need to pop in into your virtual box try it out or and eventually if you like it you put it on USB and you run it all right I'm pausing till this is all done well everything is finished we have our 2.2 gigabytes Alec Linux B budgie why maybe this big you wonder well because budgie relies on gnome so gnome and budgie are installed on that system so where does it end it ends in here in the arch iso and out we have this iso that you can uh, try out and change so if you say okay you mount this on uh, in your virtual box and then you decide maybe maybe i should do something else i should add stuff so here is the file you need to edit and see okay is, is firefox it was in there i don't want firefox genie is in there i don't want genie the only thing that's my recommendation that you do is put a hashtag in front of it so later you can do a compare between what we have online and what you have and it's easily viewed it's only hashtag difference between your line and my line so gimp is maybe interesting for not if you're not a designer gimp and inkscape and dark table lots of things you can uh, throw out and not install by that i mean leave it in put a hashtag in front of it and um, decide in the end you will give you full control over your system and that's the video the, the text we have here in the meantime i hate i made my beautiful link here budgie this is what we'll get eventually if you install everything but uh, i wanted to show you the last thing is if 
it, this is all too difficult, then just download an ISO. So we build these scripts from time to time and we have here um, Mate in here. So Mate make this number a little bit higher so I know that people are downloading and trying out Mate. So um, there you go. If you want to know what build your ISO is, the best way to do is read this article. All right, cheers.